what's up guys, it's Jenna B and welcome to today's video. So today's video, um, if you notice my like camera quality looks a little bit different, that is because I dropped the camera that I normally film on and broke the lens. Um, it's like a camera with a detachable lens, so like I have to buy a new lens, a long big old story. Anyways, um, I'm trying to make do what I got. Um, so today's video is going to be a video that I have been super excited to film, and that is all about like how I got my flat stomach. So basically how I went from like this to this. Um, and so it's been a wild ride. Um, I feel like I have been on my fitness slash weight loss journey for so long. If you've been following my channel, you know, like, I have been striving to have, like, a flat stomach for the longest time. Like, it's, like, one of my main goals that, like, I've always wanted. So this year, I've been working extremely hard to achieve that goal. Um, and so if you don't know anything about me or my weight loss journey, um, I started off at, like, 240 pounds that's just the weight that I recorded like when I started trying to lose weight I pretty sure I was like heavier before um, and so I lost 100 pounds and then like since losing 100 pounds it's been like gain a little bit back lose some gain some lose some um, and with some of that it's been like gaining muscle um, so that's fine but then also sometimes it's been like gaining like actual like weight weight and so at the beginning of the year I just decided that I was going to work extremely hard to achieve my goals and so I'm just going to be telling you guys some of the things that I did to achieve a flat stomach now I'll have like pictures and videos going my stomach is not where I want it to be I don't necessarily want like a six pack or four pack or a two pack or anything I kinda just want like the line the definition lines like uh, down my abdomen and that's basically it um, but I would say I'm like 75% there. Um, I still have like my little, what are they called, like love handles on the side that I'm trying to get rid of. They're not a lot, but you know, it's there. And, and then like I have a little bit of flab on my stomach. So the first thing that I did to achieve a flatter stomach is by using apple cider vinegar. And to be completely honest, I heard about this on YouTube and then people would ask me like, hey, have you ever used apple cider vinegar like throughout your journey? And I was just kind of like, no. And then I picked it up, I want to say like a month ago. And as you can see, like this is literally a month supply if you do it twice a day or drink it twice a day. Um, and I literally have like two more servings left before I have to go get another bottle. And so basically what I do is I would put it in something like this and take a shot of it. Now I didn't start off taking a shot of this because this stuff is gross. Um, I started off like diluting it, so like putting water in with the mixture and like drinking it that way. But then after a while like you kind of get used to the taste and like you put less and less water each time and you're able to take more, um, you know, without using the water and pretty soon you're just like taking a shot of it with no water. Um, so I feel like this definitely has helped tremendously. Like this, I will, you know, give its credit, like has done a really good job at, I feel like, getting rid of the stomach fat because stomach fat for me is so freaking stubborn, like it just wouldn't go. And ever since I started with this, like it's been going, honey. <laughs> so yeah I'm trying to like move along with the video faster I guess I might do separate videos for each of these products or like a couple of the products just to go more in depth but for now you know I'm trying to keep this video moving I actually have not taken my second dose of apple cider vinegar so I'll do it on camera um, you know just so y'all can see I really do this for real you know I kind of like fill it up like a little like halfway Also, they say you're not supposed to get it on your teeth because it like takes off the enamel and stuff, but I haven't been following that rule. I'm terrible. The second thing that I feel like has helped with me achieving the flat stomach is the teeny tea. And I know you guys are probably all thinking like, oh, teeny tea, everybody talks about like tea, does it really work, blah, blah, blah. I'm here to tell you that it does. I used up all the colon tea, um, so I have to get another package of that, but I have a little bit left of the like loose leaf tea. And I had to get a new tumbler because my old tumbler was disgusting, so I cannot wait to use my new tumbler. But this tea works so well. I feel like it really keeps my bloating down. Um, and I started off drinking it every single day, but now because I have so much like that I'm using, like apple cider vinegar and all that, um, I use it like every other day. Um, 
but I love this stuff so much. The colon tea I use on the days where I'm just feeling extremely bloated and like backed up because it really makes you poop like big time. And I am like, uh, like working with Teamy, I guess you can say. Like I have a coupon code and everything that you guys can use, but I literally love this tea so much. And when I buy the colon tea, like the one that I like used up, I'm literally going to be buying it with my own money. Um, so it's not like, oh, they sent it to me for free, so like, yeah, of course I love it. Um, no, I actually really like this stuff. And this is the only tea cleanse that I have tried and like seriously, seriously like loved and will keep continuing to use. Um, so yeah, Tea Me Tea definitely helps keep my bloating down. Um, and like keeps me like detoxed, if that makes sense. I love this tea. Of course, if you just drink this tea, it's not going to make you skinny like just drinking the tea. You have to put work behind products. You know what I mean? So like if you use some type of like weight loss product or something, you have to put work behind it. I will have my coupon codes and everything down below in the description box for you because they're always running like amazing promotions where you like buy something and get like something else for free. So if you want like details on Team ET and like what you can get down below in the description box. I'll have all the information. I literally love this stuff so much. I use every single day. Well, okay, I'm not I'm gonna I'm not gonna lie. I don't use all of these every single day. I mainly use these two every single day. So let me break it down for you. I have these two um, workout belts which I've done separate videos on, which I'll post the links down below in the description box for you. But basically with these, I sometimes like use this one for working out and this one for like just like around the house or I use this one for working out and then this one when I go to sleep. So basically what will happen is I'll use this one which is the TNT um, Built to Last Pro Series Belt. The link for this will be down below in the description box. I love this one because it's super inexpensive and you can buy it on Amazon and they run deals and stuff all the time so check out their Instagram page and everything love this belt um, and I'll use this to work out so I work out twice a day but lately I've only been going to the gym once a day just because I've been trying to take it easy um, and so what I'll do with this is I'll wear this in the morning to go to the gym and then when I like I'm done at the gym I'll kind of like wear this maybe throughout the day this is from waist magnet um, and it's like a stretchy like waist trainer this is a sweatband this is a waist trainer um, I'll wear it maybe like an hour throughout the day. Sometimes I don't wear this at all. Like I'll go like a week without wearing this. Um, and then this, sometimes I'll wear it when I'm sleeping because I find it super comfortable. So like right before I go to bed, I'll put this on and like wear it when I'm sleeping. And when I wake up, like, I don't know. Like I feel like that's helping. Um, and so yeah, this when I'm sleeping around the house or at the gym and this one I just use like at the gym or around the house but this one I find is most comfortable and it gives you a more um, like structure on your back if that makes sense like this one is kind of flimsy this one has like supports there we go that's the word for it um, and I love this belt this is the quiche power fitness belt belt that I can't speak I'll have the link for this down below in the description box as well as a coupon code hopefully if I can find one same with this one. Um, but yeah, I love both of these belts. Using both of these belts combined have been working amazingly. Like, they make you sweat so much. And I feel like it's just doing a lot to keep my stomach flat. Another thing that I would suggest is water, water, water. And also watch, watching your salt intake. So, when I'm at home, I will have water in this. And I will try to only drink water in this just because it's so big. And I will literally fill it up to the top and sip on this throughout the day. And, like, I'll have, like, multiple cups of these. When I'm out and about or when I'm going to the gym, I use my Camelback. And, um, I just refill it, like, as I need to. So, like, at the gym, I'll have, like, one and a half of these. Um, and then when I'm at home, I mean... When I'm at work or like out and about, I'll probably have like two of these. And then when I go back to the gym at night, I'll have like one and a half of these. So this, in combined with this, I'm getting a lot of water in. Also, keeping your salt intake down um, helps you from retaining extra water that you don't need to be, you know. So if you have a lot of sodium, you're going to be bloated. Um, but for me, I notice when I keep my salt intake down, I don't really bloat. Also, I would suggest eating clean. Eating clean definitely does help flatten up your stomach and tone your body out nicely. So you want to stay from processed foods anything that you go in the aisles for you want to stay around the grocery store so like veggies protein all that stuff will be on the outside fruits and veggies that kind of thing um, but yeah stay away from processed food that will really slow down your stomach 
process. So the last thing that I have to tell you guys about is Bikini Bod and this bottle has something on it so I'm not going to show you an up close look at it. Oh just kidding. I took it off. Um, but Bikini Bod is something that I have been using for a while now on and off and so the first time that I tried to get a flat stomach and I kind of did like I was probably like 55% there. Um, I used this and it works wonders and it still works wonders but because I take pre-workout I don't want to mix the two because this does have caffeine in it um, so you don't want to have too much going on in your body because it could like make your heartbeat like go all out of whack um, which is very dangerous um, and so yeah I use this now I will say like before using this like I'm not a doctor or anything so like you should use this with caution or ask your doctor about it um, but I actually love this stuff so much and it's like super natural um, and it definitely helps like burn the fat like you know I ooh the bottle fell open <laughs> um, I love this stuff so much and I like always talk about it and I have a coupon code that you guys can use down below in the description box because once upon a time I did work with them but um, my coupon code still works um, so I always put it in the description of the videos, but I love this stuff so much and if you're just starting on your journey, this is something that I would suggest using. It's perfect. Um, it definitely helps like jump start your journey and stuff like that. I need to do an updated video just specifically on Bikini Bod, but I'm going to be using Bikini Bod in combined with all of this stuff for this week coming up because I have a trip that I'm going on on Sunday and I want to achieve like the flattest stomach I can get before then um, so I'm going to be filming hopefully every single day um, I just have to film with this big camera but like a vlog style you know type deal where I show you guys literally everything that I do so when I wake up and you, I'll show you guys me with that belt on when I go to the gym me with the other belt on me taking my apple cider vinegar me all the water that I drink the meals that I have just so you get an idea of how all this stuff works together and combined with me taking this so be prepared for that that's coming up this week starting tomorrow is when I start filming you know all of that and I'll have a video hopefully a vlog every day that I'm doing it um, so yeah look out for that and give this video a thumbs up if you want to see that like so you can see how all this stuff works together and then at the end of the week I'll do like a video with before and after shots of like how my stomach looked before and then how it looked after the seven days of doing all this <laughs> so yeah look out for that but yeah bikini bod this link will be down below in the description box with the coupon code um, so that's the end of this video. That's basically all that I've been doing to get like my fat stomach as well as working out sometimes twice a day, sometimes one time a day. Really focusing on weights. Weights really helps tone your body up completely but it really does help with your stomach fat and like toning up that way. Um, when I was doing cardio I noticed my stomach wasn't as together. You know it was kind of a little like floppy if, you, if that makes sense. But adding in weights definitely really does help. So, that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know um, what other kind of videos you want to see from me down below in the comments, and I'll be sure to do that. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram for updates. I always post body updates on my Instagram story, as well as, like, just pictures and stuff, so definitely go follow me there. Um, you can DM me any questions you have, but that is pretty much it for this video, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!